marketing, etc. Dusting You are already accustomed to the word dust. However, how do you get rid of dust? A piece of dry cloth is used to wipe any surface and the action is referred to as dusting because it picks up any loose dust. A fresh, soft cloth should be used for this. Dusting with a cloth Dusting procedure Dusting is done with a variety of tools such as a cotton or muslin cloth known as a duster, dusting brush, vacuum cleaner and so on. Select your cleaning supplies appropriately for the job such as a dusting brush for cleaning computers, fans and light bulbs and a muslin cloth duster for dusting tables and other surfaces with electronic devices. Always dust after sweeping because dust spreads during sweeping and collects on the items present in the area. To prevent needless time and energy waste, dusting should be done methodically. Prior to dusting, make a list of the items that need to be cleaned. Then, start by dusting the high up items such as ceiling fans and light bulbs before moving down to clean paintings, artifacts, tables, etc. To clean properly, always dust an item in either a clockwise or counterclockwise motion. Keep in mind to always move the dust from its original location in order to thoroughly clean both the upper surface of the objects as well as the dust underneath. As soon as your dusting cloth gets dirty, shake it or rinse it to remove the dust. Please refrain from shaking the dusting cloth inside your home because this could make it even dirtier. To remove dust from difficult areas such as behind furniture and ceiling fans, use a synthetic duster with a long handle or stick. Remove dust from the nooks and crevices of the furniture with a small paintbrush. Clean dust from the oil painted walls with a damp mop or swiffer and the other walls with a muslin cloth or synthetic brush. Using a damp cloth, remove dust from non-wood furniture while cleaning it. The air filter should be taken out and thoroughly washed under running water while cleaning the air conditioners. It should then be dried before being replaced. You should also clean the outside of the air conditioner. Clean the floor as soon as you finish dusting. Otherwise, the entire dust will be laid there. Remember to put the dust and debris in the trash can. Tips When cleaning paintings, mirrors, artifacts and other items, always use a high quality cleaning product. Whenever you notice food or drink stains on a tabletop, immediately wipe them away. Always clean off the surface of tables and chairs that are hidden from view because this is where cobwebs and dust tend to collect. Do not forget to dust the corners of your furniture. To properly dust the house, create a dusting calendar detailing the items to be cleaned daily, weekly and monthly. For the elderly caretaker, it streamlines and makes the entire process very systematic. After cleaning or washing, always store dusting tools for future use. When cleaning exclusive areas of the house, always use unique dusters and brushes. Prior to sweeping, always put on a breathing mask or secure a cloth around your mouth and nose to prevent dirt inhalation. Clean the window sill, window panes and window grill on a regular basis. To clean ceiling fans, exhaust fans and other similar devices, use a damp cloth and cleaning solution. Place all of the dust in a garbage bag and tightly close it before throwing it away. 
to clean the carpets, rugs, sofas and mattresses, use a vacuum cleaner. Cover your head at all times to protect your hair.